Thank you, Ashling. Now, the national finals of the Formula One in schools competition took place in Dublin yesterday, and the 27 finalists from all over the country were there to battle it out for the top prizes. I went along to check it out. And they're off. Fresh from the regional rounds, the finalists were on top form for the Formula One in schools finals and ready to battle it out on the track. Each team had to design a miniature Formula One car using computers, and then they were made out of wood using this machine, which takes the instructions from the computer and shaves the wood accordingly. And there were some very interesting designs to be seen. We designed the car on, on the computer. We based it on a, a teardrop. Uh, in other words, to make it go faster because it's um, more streamlined. Then we just painted all purple for the regions because we wouldn't have time to like paint, paint it two colours. And then for today we painted it silver on top. So it's the same design but different colours. Yeah. Our car is an R-type CO2 powered car. We all entered the competition last year and because of this we had to add on the wings and the airfoils and the front wing onto the car. Um, our colour scheme is the black and pink. It's, we use the black because it's a good basic colour and the pink for the classic girly look. For the final event, the teams had to race their cars against each other and present their marketing and design plans to the team of judges. You were up in the with the judges. Tell me, what was that like? Um, it was extraordinary. Um, it was very nerve-wracking and we just talked about our journey through this whole um, experience for Formula One in schools. We took up for advertising um, our car on these. Um, we took up cups, uh, coasters, mouse mats and we made um, lots more things as well. We've got this personalised cake which is made in the food store in Clermars and we've got all these jackets, t-shirts, shirts and bags. So to meet all the requirements every team had to have its own specialists. So this team has a manager, an engineer, graphic designer, other engineer, resources, marketing and then there's me. Can I be on the team? Yeah. But it was the final and out of 150 entries, Team Coney Cats from Greystones in County Wicklow came out on top overall and in the senior category. In the under 15 age group, Sharks from Ophir College in Dundalk were the winners. The skills we've learned such as the, um, designing it on the computers and actually making the stand and the car itself uh, is so it's amazing how easy these experiences and how, what we've learned could have passed us by. The top prize winners get a trophy, €5,000 in cash and the opportunity to represent Ireland at the World Formula One in Schools competition next spring. Now, lots of you gave us your views about yesterday's report on Glenn, the seven-year-old Limerick child.